Amen. And the winner is... First one we pull. The Mark P. You are the winner of this. Congratulations. He only had one ticket, by the way. It's pretty crazy, right? It's pretty crazy. What's going on, YouTube? Welcome to Today we have a crazy unboxing from all you guys who did trades with me. Some of you guys sent me some extra stuff as a gift. I got all of it. I've been hoarding it. I'm ready to get to it. I got to just mask up and tape up everything. Uh, if you guys were wondering what that was yesterday, we recently just put up our merch for able to buy in the streams. Uh, you can probably buy them off streams. But those were the people that came in and then bought it. If you bought more than a regular amount, like if you bought like 60 bucks or 70 bucks, I'd put your name in there three times. It was just crazy that the guy who originally bought the first one was the winner of that. Congratulations to Mark P. Uh, we had you on the live stream. And we had merch up. They bought it. First day it dropped. I put them all in there. Congratulations. We'll probably do another one soon. Do I have another hand wrap? I guess I do. Ugh. Get them out. It'll be easier. Actually, we'll pull the winner at the end. I'm doing what I enjoy doing. It's like other men like to play golf, so they play golf every chance they can. So you don't say to them, how come you're playing golf today? You played last week. It was the same with me. To me, it is such fun creating characters, writing stories. It's an exciting life. And when you do something that you know the fans seem to enjoy, that gives you such satisfaction, you don't want to stop. Woo, boy. Had these for a couple days, probably about a week or so, but we have some amazing stuff here that I wanted to share with you guys. And it's been a little bit easier for me to just do it with a little casual. I think I did this once before, it's like a casual unboxing video. If you guys want to check out the reviews of these and watch me do the unboxing of them, like per piece, check me out on twitch.tv live to clear I'm live. These were either trades for Magics or Emma Frost or gifts from you guys. This has been a pretty amazing community so far in the Marvel Legends community. I am pumped. I'm gonna start with that one first. This came from my boy, the one and only, Jake Stats, Funko Boston, moderator, long time supporter of the channel, a athlete himself, does karate, trying to get that MMA career going. Good luck to you, my man. Wishing you guys a happy and safe, safe coronavirus. They just pushed us down back to May 15th now. We got more time to hang out and chill and a little bit more entertainment. Again, if you guys want that merch, hit me up while I'm in the live stream. I'll send you the link to pick it up. Uh, the first one we have from our boy, Danny Moonstar. Ah, you thought you got away, baby. You thought you got away. You thought you got away. Three head sculpts it comes with. You're gonna have to pick up a few of these. I might have traded with some of them. You might see them in this video. But bam, baby, bam. Pretty pumped. Oh, that was a pain in the butt to get one. I ran like 10 miles for that. Next up, we got this box from Gudon Brown. This one I might have purchased off of him. We'll see in a second. Coming with the double box and the packaging. And we have ourselves, ooh, Marvel's Mystique. I definitely bought this off him for like 30 bucks shipped. Check that out, boom. Very pumped and excited to put that on my female shelf. Holla at your boy. Got them female figs, let me know. Lisa Wreck. Life of Cletus. I don't know who Lisa Wreck is, but I know I did a trade 
for a magic for this guy. This was the Jack O' Lantern Marvel Legend fig, and it comes with the Build a Figure piece as well. X Men female figs and the Spider Man villains is what I've been after. Comes that has all his accessories. Pretty cool. Then we got this box from Lewis Colin. This came in and it was wrapped like this. That was ballsy. That was ballsy. It has to be the same person. Let's see what we got. Oh, we got a fig. Oh, yes, it is. Oh, yes, yes. True to his word, young man, you are one awesome dude. Wow. I'm pumped for this. So far, my favorite one, Phoenix. Ah, oh, man. She looks so good. She looks so flocking good. Oh my lord, she looks good. Thank you so flocking much. That is a dope fig. I love her hair, colors. Oh, awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Thank you for that. Following up with, ah, the villain, the Silver Samurai. Joe Santos has been telling me about this figure over and over and over and over again to pick it up. And I, I was gonna do it, but then my man hit me up with this and said, hey, I got you, bro. He is gonna go perfect with the Ronin Mezco figure I have. I have not showed that video yet, so we gotta get to it. We're gonna unbox this in a live stream, even though the card's like perfect. To cry and take him out of the box, but we gotta live our life. We gotta live our life. YOLO. Next up, we got a package from Produced by Studios. Everything goes to the P.O. Box. If you guys wanna know where the P.O. Box is, it's in the link in the description. Let me know if you send something and I'll go pick it up. I have to run there. It is not the same one that you think I'm going to down the road. It's a further one. I go to the Rich Town for my P.O. Box. Oh my Lord, you bastard. Those flocking white turtles. Oh, the original comic book set. I had the game at GameStop during Christmas time. Oh, you just complete myself. This was exclusive to Walmart. And when I would go looking in the stores, they never had them, 35 years. Man, that's an awesome piece. I asked Punky, what should I do? Should I unbox the last ones? And she's like, nope, you don't do that. So these guys, I don't think they're gonna get unboxed. As you guys know, we own the NECA black and white ones and we bought the new ones as well. So, oh, I'm gonna have to keep these guys in box with the other ones. I love the artwork on this. Thank you so much, Produced by Studios. You are the flocking man, baby. I'm gonna save King Zachary's for last. Travis Zimmer. Zimmer. Zimmer, 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 Zimmer. Damn it, who stole my knife? The thief is back. I believe we traded for these two magics for Danny, Mother Flockin' Moonstar. Holy flocking yes. One and two. Again, remember when I right mentioned that they're gonna be like regional figures that are exclusive? Well, these were basically over there and he couldn't find any of the magics. So it was a simple trade for us. Both paid the same and then we had to ship these bad boys. Boom to you, congratulations to me. Holla flocking Rula, Rula. Uh, this box is from a toy company, so we're gonna unbox that. Probably when we unbox something else, maybe like a big bad toy store order. Now this mother flocker was a gift from the one and only King Zachary, you might know him as Pin Patrol, and his brother Tammy, his brother Tammy. Uh, he wrote, do not razor. Mother Flocker went hard on this. Check that out. You got the old school cards. Where did you find those? He said he sent me something delicious, something good. And I'm excited to see. Oh, thank you for the follow on uh, on Twitch. Uh, Stefan RJ Vaughn. Appreciate that. Starting out first, we got a letter. We just got a letter. He's so cool. He has his own little cards. Zachary, and he has his last name. And it says Cletus. Flock you, bro. It says Flock you sincerely. The former greatest YouTuber ever. Hashtag thumbnails. Oh man, look at that. We got some we got some merch. We got some Flock You merch. Oh my fucking god. This fucking guy is ridiculous. He sent me a picture of himself. Knock him dead, champ. Sign by the one and only King Zachary. Pin patrol. Thumbnails from God. Himself and his brother Tammy are off the flocking charts. He literally sent me 
you know, that's probably like 350 in, in ink. How much, how much money you got? You can, you can print this out yourself. I hope it's a CVS in front of this. It's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> I can't wear that because you're too tall. <laughs> Thank you, my man. Ooh, six scale. Oh, my man, he sells the one six scale cleaning kit. This must be it. Look at that right there. Little cloth, little, little packaging. Looks pretty cool. Oh, Iron Man Mark 7 keychain. Get the fuck out of here. That's pretty freaking awesome. If you guys don't know, he actually made a RC racing car out of this. He also made a mask out of this. He rebuilt this box that was damaged out of ramen noodles. He will forever be the Mark 7 king of shipper boxes. How many did you order that you were able to do all that? What else we got? Oh, here's the kit, the scale kit. Uh, I'll leave the link for this kit in there. Uh, he sells out of them all the fucking time. And he was on our podcast just recently. But you literally, this goes in that. You can pump that, clean that up. You got the solution, the cleaning solution for your leather. What in the world is this? Oh, look at that little brush. Ah, oh. I like that. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I like that because I don't feel like a girl. I can put this in my pocket, you know. The other stuff, you know, I'm supposed to use the girlfriend's makeup brush. I ain't doing that. And then there's like a see-through thing here. I don't know what that's for, but it says uh, set includes dust blaster, detailed brush, microfiber cloth, synthetic leather conditioner. He is the man. He knows what he's talking about with these things. He is a one stick scale king and obsession. First fig, ooh, ah, yes. Nobody loves female figs more than the hammer. We got ourselves Gamora. God damn it, the build of fig is mantis. What are they, flocking crazy? Are they flocking crazy with this? What, what, what if, nobody wants mantis. That's ridiculous. I see nebulas on the back here though. Gamora, she comes with a bunch of guns. Comes with a build a figure that we will definitely not be building. Is it like the legendary female big figure that you have to build? I don't know. We're not doing that, but that's pretty good. Thank you, sir. And then there was one more. He said it was a grail piece. Said it was something delicious. Something delicious. And we have the silver surfer. Okay. Good thing about this is I just recently bought this mother flocker. Right? You saw me unbox it. Maybe do a giveaway. Maybe we won't. Maybe we will, but not for this. We'll do it for a magic figure. How about that for you guys who stuck around? This one I'm keeping, the other one I'm returning back to Amazon. Get my $60 back. And Bibby Pop Hunter is about to get me the Human Torch one for the old school Walgreens uh, ones. Let me know, boys. If you find them Walgreens, let me know. Let me know, please. Let me know. Yeah, baby. More pump now because now I get my $60 hairs back and I can put it towards something more crazy. Hashtag the mask game is annoying wow we got some crazy stuff the girlfriend was getting really mad at me because i just kept hoarding everything and getting more boxes in i was picking up everything so let's bring it all in <laughs> all right guys so that was my amazing unboxing uh again being part of the marvel legend community and getting part of it and being involved in it these people like to trade it's not like funko pops it's not like uh, SH figure watch. It's not like anything else that I've been part of because usually those higher end collectors are very greedy and they want every cent for everything that's worth and they want to get one up on you. For me, I felt like it was a great little trade off for me to get rid of some figs that I picked up as doubles quadruples maybe 15 or 16 of and be able to add stuff like these in them especially these Danny's moon stars where you can just go in your area we can trade them you guys hear me talking about it in the other videos when we're hunting off the charts my boy Zachary coming in studio these figs are off the flocking charts 
I can't believe we finally got this, and I bought myself that Mystique figure as well. I guess I'll keep this flocking thing in the background for a few videos or live streams. I'll leave the link to his description and to the channel for this giveaway. So let me go grab one. So we're gonna do another giveaway plus the other giveaway at the end. So for this giveaway, I'm giving away a $75 fig. It's called the Magic Figure. What you're gonna have to do is you're gonna go to Pin Patrol's channel. You're gonna have to leave a comment on his last video and then I'm gonna pull a winner for there. Hope you guys enjoy it. It's for you. I'll pull a winner during a live stream. I'll reply to your comment in the comment section if you won and you weren't at the live stream. So I hope you guys enjoy that. And the other winner for the other hand wrap is going to be, Jay's getting pumped, there's boxes on the floor. Let's mix these up a little bit. Uh, who's that? Garwood. Garwood got that bad boy. And here's the rest of them, so you don't want any cheat your asses. That is it. Hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing and these amazing trades with these guys. Keep up the good work. Get out there, get some grinding on. Hope you guys are entertained with all my videos. Oh, I still got a few more unboxing videos to come. See you in the next one. Boop.